What's up guys, it's Lou from Unbox Therapy, just picked up the new iPod Touch. This is still the 4G, it's still rocking an A4 processor, but it's now available in white, and it is also going to ship with iOS 5, so you're not going to have to update it when you get it home, not a huge deal, but nice nonetheless. So I'm going to give you guys a breakdown of the new OS, iOS 5 that is, and uh, I'm not going to do it in this video though, I'm going to save it for another one because obviously it's too much to cover. So the very next video I do, I'll give you the breakdown of iOS 5, uh, the changes and features that have been added, and uh, let you guys know exactly why you should be interested in it. But let's talk about this unboxing because that is where we're at right now. The very first thing in the box was the iPod Touch. This is an 8 gigabyte. The price dropped, which is nice as well, down to $199. We got the boring paperwork that we gotta we gotta get through, including the ubiquitous Apple stickers. Please don't throw those <laughs> on your bumper of your car. All right, fine. If you absolutely have to, go ahead. But and then we got the sync cable, but I shouldn't even call it the sync cable because you can now sync wirelessly in iOS 5. So it's a charge cable. But hey, you can still sync with it if you want to kick it old school. The headphones are basic. There is no remote, no microphone, bog standard. I did notice that the connector is a little more robust than on previous generation touches. I did notice that on the new Nano that I unboxed as well. Now, we got to release this iPod Touch from its shackles and we got to put it into service. So you got to pull down that tab and that'll loosen it up real good. And then from there, you got to remove this fake iPod Touch sticker on the front side here. Anybody in need of a fake sticker? <laughs> You can stick that on your on your other device and pretend it's an iPod Touch. So we got the camera on the back as well as the volume buttons. Of course, the 30-pin connector along bottom, our headphone jack, and a little baby speaker. And on the front, we have our forward-facing camera as well as our home button and then the power button along top. So let's boot this up, see if we can get a quick little preview, a little glimpse of this iOS 5 goodness. So there it is. Uh, no more are we greeted by that terrible connect this to iTunes <laughs> logo. No, now we're good to go straight out of the gates. It's kind of like setting up a laptop. Actually, you pick your region along with whether or not you want to opt into location services. I'm going to say no for now. Maybe I'll activate that at a later date. We'll have to wait and see. And then uh, you connect it to Wi-Fi and that's how this whole thing happens. I'm not going to let you guys see my password though. I know some of you are probably waiting to come on over here and hack my network get some free wi-fi right <laughs> i'm just kidding i know you guys are you guys are good kids right so i'm gonna skip over entering my apple id for the sake of this video and here's where you say yes to the terms and conditions sign your life away to apple forever all right never mind i'm kidding about that. <laughs> don't be scared <laughs> and uh, a couple of check marks and we're in and you can see already it's ios 5 because it's brand new icons and whatnot but let's go into the general settings here and make sure that the version is correct and there it is version 5.0 yes we have ios 5 goodness preloaded now as you guys know this thing is super slim a real pretty device you probably already knew that because of the black model and um hey if you were thinking about getting one and you wanted it in white now well i guess now is the time to bite uh, it feels real good in the hand Anyway, guys, if you don't mind, hopefully you could like and favorite this video as it does help me out a bunch. And um, stay tuned for that iOS 5 video. I'm going to go over the new features and functions, give you guys a breakdown, tell you why you should upgrade, tell you how to utilize the new things. And remember to check out my new channel as well uh, by clicking that button right in front of you. Anyway, guys, until next time, and as always, thanks for watching. Later.